Hey everyone, so I was at a business networking meeting this morning um, and I wanted to share with you guys my spiel, my thing that I say every week. Um, so every week I talk about the, you know, what the the thing of the day is, right? Like, so, the, what do we call it? Like the national, uh, national day, right? So today, if you don't know, on uh, June 1st is the start of the LGBTQI plus Pride Month. So I'm going to share with you what I said to my group. And um, surprisingly, I got a little emotional um, when I was talking about it. And I think, you know, I got emotional not just because it's um, a super important month, um, but also because I, it makes me realize, especially, you know, I'm living in Florida and all of the crazy things that are being passed right now, the things that are being um, talked about, the way that kids are being influenced in schools. Um, and yeah, so I think everything just kind of culminated for me and uh, reading my, my talk today or reading my spiel today made me feel a certain way. And so I wanted to share that with everybody because maybe it will help you. Maybe it will help someone that you know. Maybe it will just bring the the conversation to the table a little bit more and, and kind of humanize what's actually happening um, right now within our governments and, and especially here in Florida. So what I talked about today, um, I said today is the start of LGBTQI plus Pride Month, which remembers the start of the gay rights movement on the night of June 28th, 1969 when police raided the Stonewall Inn, a gay club in New York City, brutally and forcefully arresting and beating bar owners and patrons out of their clubs and bars. To remember those that lost their lives to start the revolution of freedom for people in the LGBTQI plus community, we always offer a safe and judgment-free place to feel and move your best. Being in pain or not moving as well as you'd like is hard as it is, but when you don't feel safe to be who you are, or share things in your life that directly affect your health and well-being, it makes it that much more difficult. So please tell the people that you know struggling to find a health practitioner that makes them feel comfortable that at Body Mechanics PT we are here for them and we're here for all of them. So I hope you guys can share this message with someone that you know, someone that may be struggling to find, someone that understands them or um, just wants to feel safe in their own health and wellness. Um, we're here for them.